St. Constantine and Helen Parrish, this is Father Pondelemon offering you uh, another little reflection for the week. Um, today, I want to do something a little different. Uh, for the past four sessions, I have been focusing on a document that was put out a while ago by the Office of Youth and Young Adult Ministry for the Archdiocese. Um, and, and entitled Exodus from Orthodoxy. Today, I, I don't want to talk about that. I'm going to pick up on that again, I think, next time. Today, I actually want to talk about a conversation I had with a parishioner yesterday that I think is important and, and kind of demonstrates something that is good for us to think about. And to give a, a quick summary, basically, I, I was at an event talking to a, a woman who had a, a, a daughter, and the daughter had gone to a school, and the school was kind of far away for college. And uh, when the mother initially took the daughter to this distant college, uh, the mother that, that same weekend when she sort of dropped her off, she went to the Orthodox Church there with her daughter to sort of plug her into the Orthodox Church. And to, to the sort of dismay, I would say terror of the parent, uh, nobody greeted them. She said that the, the whole time they were there, coffee hour they sat down, nobody came up to them. And I, I really, I, I don't know what happens to visitors at our parish because I'm not a visitor and I, I, I'm usually tied up, uh, you know, certainly during liturgy and also uh, for at least 10 or 15 minutes after liturgy. So uh, what I want to do today is I, I just want to plant a seed in your head that it is so important, so incredibly important that we reach out to people who come and visit our community. Uh, I, I cannot stress this enough. Um, I remember reading an article once that said something I thought was, was interesting. The author said that if, if you are a member of a parish, meaning if this is the parish you regularly attend, right, then on Sundays, you are not a guest, you are a host. Let me say that again. If you are the regular attendee of a particular parish, let's say you come to St. Constantine and Helen, you know, typically on Sundays, on Sundays, you are not a guest, you are a host. What does that mean? It means that when people are there who you don't recognize, maybe someone you see, you know, in coffee hour, maybe someone you see as they're exiting church after they've been given on Didero, if you don't know someone, then it is your job to go up to that person and introduce yourself and greet them and welcome them and get them a cup of coffee and get them a plate of cookies. And, you know, if they're in a certain demographic, maybe they're a young family with kids, you can introduce them to another young family with kids. Or if they're a single young adult, you can introduce them to another single young adult. This is such a powerful ministry that we all need to take seriously. And before I end, I want to make one important point. You know, a lot of times we sort of we sort of outsource welcoming either to a welcoming ministry, which, you know, we should have, or to the priest. And I have to tell you, first of all, let me talk about the priest. The priest is very, very, very busy on Sundays. Um, and very importantly, when people come into church, right, during the liturgy, I am obviously not able to greet them. After liturgy, I have to consume what's left of Holy Communion. I have to take off my vestments, which means typically it takes about 10 to 15 minutes after I've given out the last piece of Andidron before I can even get over to coffee hour. And by then, let's be honest, if a visitor hasn't been greeted at that point, they're probably gone, right? And while we do have a welcoming committee, and that's an important ministry, everyone should consider themselves part of the welcoming committee because ultimately, that's what we've been commissioned to do. You know, the, in the baptismal service, it, it refers to the person being baptized as the newly commissioned soldier of Christ God, right? And that's you. If you're Orthodox and you're listening to the, this podcast, you are the newly commissioned soldier of Christ. And part of that means going out, you know, into the world and welcoming the people that come and, and, and being, you know, being a greeter, even if you're not a and so, uh, you know, in summary, I guess I would simply say, I, I really pray, I pray that under my tenure, there is never a family that comes here, never a college student or a parent with their college child or, or anyone, a, a young family with kids that comes and, and really nobody goes up to them and nobody says hello. I mean, the reality is, how horrible would that be if that were you and your child somewhere else, right? It would be horrible. Right? If we bring our kids to church in, I don't know, California, hoping you know they're going to be at school there, hoping they'll connect with somebody, and nobody pays any attention to us. How horrible is that for us? And I, I think you know it goes both ways, right? If we want 
that elsewhere, we need to be doing that here, right? So uh, today, brothers and sisters, please consider yourself commissioned to go out on a Sunday and welcome anyone and everyone you see who you don't know, all right? God bless you. Have a beautiful week.